Hey guys, so today I'm going to talk about the most dominant deck. It is the Aldrazi deck in Modern. It has pretty much dominated this entire format out of nowhere. It is six of the top eight decks. I don't remember a any Pro Tour being like this where you have eight decks, six of them are Aldrazi, and then two of them are Affinity. There's only two decks, so it's not diverse. The deck is very good. It plays its Ghost Corners, its Spell Skites. Even if Twin were not banned, Twin cannot compete with this. No deck can complete compete with Adrazi. It just wins. It wins over 70% of the time. And you cannot sideboard against it. Like, what are you going to sideboard against this? It's not Affinity where you have Artifact Hate. It is crazy to me uh, what how far Wizards has pushed Aldrazi. Uh, there's no diversity in the format at all. I expected this to happen with Tron, and that was my mistake. This actually happened with a deck more suited to selling booster packs, Oath of the Gatewatch booster packs, than even Tron. I mean, the whole deck, Matter Reshaper, Seer, uh, Reality Breaker, Mimic, well, like all these cards are from the new set, meaning that if you want them, you should buy more cards. Now, if you look at the cards with 16 or more occurrences in the top eight of each modern PT, they're pretty much just land, just land, and that's it. So you have Ponder, you have Remand, very good cards. Uh, 2016, in 2015, there was only two cards, Lightning Bolt and Lightning Bolt being one of the best and most played cards, Lightning Bolt is not a single copy is played at the Pro Tour right now. That's insane. That means the power level is crazy, and there's no interaction. There's no interactivity. You just play your Adrazi and go. Is this healthy for the format? I don't believe it is. Uh, I am kind of excited to see what people can brew up. I just don't know if there's a card that can beat it. It's too fast. It's too strong. It It's strong enough that you don't even look at Lightning Bolt. You don't even play Lightning Bolt, even if you're in red in this color. Like, it's not worth it. So we banned Splinter Twin because we felt like the we wanted diversity. And this is what we got. Pretty crazy, if you ask me.